Anne is a scientist studying the liver, and she wants Claude to help her quickly analyze the genomics data set and form some new hypotheses. Anne can easily share data with Claude, or Claude can retrieve query results from platforms like Synapse or Snowflake. Claude is a powerful research assistant, exploring patterns in the data using common bioinformatics methods. Claude produces visualizations to understand the trends, and it shows its work, so Anne can easily review and reproduce its analysis. Claude helps Anne by identifying cellular processes and structures that might be of interest. Anne picks one that piques her curiosity. To help make sense of the patterns, Anne uses Claude for the time-consuming work of reviewing scientific literature to address a fundamental question. What's already known and what is new? In minutes, Claude helps Anne confirm a number of genes already known to have functions in the liver. And, interestingly, a host of others that don't appear to have been well studied before. These are especially interesting, so Anne works with Claude to dive deeper. Claude combs through the literature, and because it's connected to PubMed, it can access actual papers, clarify details of the author's experimental approaches, and find specific mentions that help Anne determine novelty or applicability. With links back to the source materials, Anne can dig deeper into relevant publications. Claude does the labor-intensive bioinformatics and literature review, so Anne can spend her time on the creative work of experimentation and discovery. Finally, Anne wants to synthesize her analysis into a presentation. In just a few minutes, Claude creates a deck of the summary charts, including citations and quotes. Anne reviews the slides and spots one that needs a better figure. Claude replaces it with a scientific diagram of the liver from BioRender, putting the final touches on Anne's presentation. <laughs>